Hey guys, welcome back into another video. Today we're checking out Threshold Token as it continues to pump in the crypto markets today. Now trading at 0.048, up 13% on the 24 hour and up 14% against Bitcoin. It's rank 86 with a $415 million market cap. So it's looking pretty good over the last day. Huge pump last week has been a slight downtrend from the uh, huge euphoric top that we saw. And looking at the volume, we can see 400 uh, an 87 diluted market cap right there and 287 million dollars 24 hour volume most of that is coming from binance bithum and also coinbase as well so really really crazy etherscan is suggesting there's just under 4,000 holders i don't know how accurate that truly is i feel like for some reason it would be so much higher and i just think you know it looks really really good at the moment so we're going to look at a bit of price analysis if you're new to the channel get yourself into my discord check out those links down below they could also make some money not financial advice for example before we get started metamasters guild a really cool pre-sale that i am invested in in the play to earn sector so have a look at that one link down below and remember guys it's all speculative not financial advice and let's check it out let's see what's going on so recently we can see what i can see mainly is there's two things that I'm, I'm looking at. It's this candle here, this previous weekly candle with the larger blow off top where we saw a massive selling pressure. And we've, of course, got a similar candle in terms of the actual movement itself. So this candle here moved up by 85 percent. This candle here moved up by 176 percent. So we're seeing sort of similar euphoria and, and hype around the particular pump. So back above that 20 day moving average on the weekly time frame. But it does look like there's a few key areas of resistance that we're getting hit upon. So it's this one here and it says diagonal resistance at around 0 0.065. And now we've also flipped 0 0.06 into a resistance level as well. So we need to see if we can pump back through that particular range. Really, really overbought on the uh, daily RSI and four hour as well. But we have touched down on that 0.5 Fibonacci at 0.04 dollars which does show a good sign of consolidation and support but it is printing a doji candle uh, which actually reflects equal buying and selling pressure in the market so now we're moving down to the daily time frame we can see here was the huge pump this was the huge area of resistance that we can see where we we're producing higher highs but we did see that roll over to the downside over here for um threshold network token what i really want to see now is a bounce up to 0 0.06 and then some positive price continuation up to this upper resistance trend line that we're seeing right here of 0 0.064 so it's really difficult to say what is going to happen right now in the crypto markets i do hope to see some positive continuation to the upside for this token um it does look like it's respecting uh this particular support level quite significantly see that we're just producing some lower uh, lows and on the fibonacci extension side of things again you know that was a perfect touch down to uh, 6.8 which is the golden pocket i mean that is not even a coincidence on this four hour time frame we went from overbought into almost an oversold position and here is that bounce that we're seeing right now so we could also analyze this particular bump and say the same thing you know are we now seeing a 0.5 correction or will we come down to the 0.618 at 0.046 before pumping even harder once again so we need to see if this is a corrective phase or whether this is now going to be like a major resistance in this descending channel right here that we can see looking at the bollinger bands we're pretty overextended we're above that 20 day moving average we are getting some volume come through which is of course important as well so interesting insights here i'm really keen to see how this is going to play out moving into the one hour we're producing some uh higher lows and lower highs so it's starting to look a bit like a symmetrical triangle formation here but again guys it's all speculative we don't know what truly is going to happen uh but let's keep an eye on it because you know this looks exciting right here we've got a bit of a bull flag formation we could pump up to 0.056 or we could actually lose support over here at 0.048 and then flop back down to 0.038. So anything can really, really happen in these markets right now. Uh, what else is going on? Fear and Greed Index. We're actually got a neutral market at the moment, which is a very rare sight. And also the narrative is now being spun back to bearish because there were some liquidations. Oh, terrifying. Yes, we're going to get longs. We're going to get liquidations. Same news all the time. It's pretty irrelevant in my opinion. If you're a viewer's long term, this sort of stuff doesn't mean too much to me anyway. And again, Bitcoin suffers largest daily plunge since November sink below 22.6k, but we've recovered from like 16k following an FTX crash black swan event. So in my opinion, things are looking quite good still long term. And looking at this particular chart here, it shows the uh, consumer behavior and all the addresses holding, you know, X amount of Bitcoin on the left that we can see well over the last three days. 
the addresses holding between 0 0.1 and 1 Bitcoin has actually gone up by a few thousand. So we're getting more whole coiners in markets. Anyways, guys, a fresh reminder to come say hi in the Discord channel. Don't be shy. Come say hi. Um, you know, there's so many great people in here. There's over 2,000 people. Uh, we've got moderators. We've got people helping in the community. We've got quizzes, chess tournaments, just hanging out. We've got signals. We've got pre-sales. We've got trading signals like this sort of stuff here where people are also making a bit of money too. So it depends on what you're really looking for. And don't forget to check out the pre-sales. I have linked down below. I'm most bullish on MetaMasters Guild and also the Fight Out pre-sale. So do have a little look. We can see this one's already raised $2.2 million. Uh, one Memag at the moment is 0. 0.016 in stage four of the pre-sale and you know guys in literally four days three hours this token is going to go up to 0.019 dollars what's interesting about this pre-sale i'm going to show it to you do your own research of course look at the white paper do your own due diligence it says the exchange listing price is 0.023 dollars and that shows that we could potentially have immediate profits i'm just going over what i see on the screens here i mean anything could actually happen but yeah that's about a wrap Ladies and gents, I hope you enjoyed. If you're new, subscribe, like, comment, do all those YouTube thingies, and uh, let's see if this thing can pump a bit further. Maybe we can even target $1 billion market cap. Anyways, links down below. Take care. See you soon.